Welcome back everybody to my channel. Today I'll be doing another reaction to JoJo's Bizarre Adventure episode uh, 4 of part 3 Stardust Crusaders titled Tower of Grey. And last episode uh, our group of little friend the Abdul, uh, Jojo from part 2, Joseph, and uh, Jotaro and Kakuin, a random bad guy that became good. Uh, all, I guess he's also a high school student. They're setting off to find Dio, defeat him probably, and uh, save uh, Jotaro's mom. So, uh, without much to say, uh, let's jump into episode 4. And I hope you guys enjoy my reactions. So, yeah, let's go. There is an emotion called fear. It's very much emotion. Okay, so now we are meeting an old granny that's talking about fear. Okay, there is a lot of naked people. Oh, dang! Dang! Oh, Dio got himself some girls. Okay. Did he kill her? She looks very, very charmed right now. Okay, she definitely did. Joy. Okay. So, I guess Dio is just slowly sucking blood from others. And he's not fully healed yet, right? They will not reach your destination safely. Does that mean- oh. Uh, they probably sent some person up to them to stop them. They just casually not change their outfits, right? They're still in their school uniform. Do they not have like a traveling permit? I mean, a traveling uniform? Oh, they're feeling something. They're feeling something. Oh boy. Suspense. Oh. Oh. It's a fly, isn't it? It's a fly. Oh, that's not a fly. A stag beetle. Is this supposed to look like that? We already kind of understand usually. A bug's shaped stand. Oh, I thought stands were, were supposed to be like goat, ghost like phantoms. I didn't know they could be like bugs. Okay, so uh, they're coming after everybody in the plane. So it seems, and they're using a bug to do so too. So I think this is going to be pretty interesting. Oh wow, opening is taking forever. You know, I can't, I just can't. I, I have to skip the opening because uh, copyright issues, guys. So if if I if you want to see my re reaction to like to these openings, like it's gonna have to be silent completely. Like hey, I don't know, but like uh here's a here's a like a quick question for you guys that are watching. Uh like oh it's faster than Star Platinum, that's a surprise. But anyway, uh so like would you guys mind like if I if I were to uh do a reaction on on this anime, on this JoJo anime do you guys mind if, like, not having any anime sound, like, like just me talking, or do you guys, like, prefer, uh, or do you guys, like, prefer, oh, shit, what the fuck is that? That looked like one of that alien predator thing. Okay, well, anyway, uh, do, do you guys, do you guys mind, uh, the anime sound of background that you guys can barely hear, or, uh, do you guys just mind it, like, silently? Because I, I don't know what you guys actually like. I I'll, I'm just trying to like figure things out. Oh, it's called Tower Grey. I'm sorry, guys. I'm not. I wasn't really focused on this anime. I just want to like ask you guys some questions. Like, you know, you guys, you guys help me out with these names and stuff. Um, that'll be very appreciated because 
I honestly don't want to like butcher these names. And uh, Star Platinum, its reaction speed is insanely fast. Rush of floats. Oh, it dodged. I thought it got hit. Oh, sounds like somebody else is talking right there. Is that a guy or girl talking? Oh, he's hiding among the normal people, isn't he? Oh, it is so fast. Oh my goodness, this beat. I'm sorry, this stag beetle is so fast. Oh! Why? Why are they going after the innocent people? Bingo! Look at their tongues. Mass yeah, I, I know what massacre means. They actually did it. Did what? All it did was kill some people and write with their names. Who is this old man? What's Atemi mean? How did defeat it for other passengers panic? Oh! <gasps> if Abdul went all out, the plane would explode. That, that's very smart. He was quite stand. Okay, so they do know about him. Hey guys, I, I, like, as usual, um, I am recording this super super late, so, uh, please don't mind me looking so tired. Isn't, isn't he supposed to be like a quiet stand? I, I don't think shooting a bunch of emeralds at inside of a plane is is not very destructive. I think this is pretty destructive right there. And how is this quiet? Oh, that is oh, nasty. What? He just got one shot it. He has to be acting, isn't he? Oh my gosh. I thought no one can dodge this stuff. This kind of... This credibility, elusibility, it's kind of, it's kind of doo doo. Oh, it got it. Look at that. Oh, 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 oh. What would happen? We still haven't seen the stand user yet. So I, I wonder if the stand gets destroyed, does the user also get destroyed? Because it seems like every time the stand gets injured, the user, it gets injured just the same. Oh shit! Yo! He was the user? So it, it really does seem like uh, if, if the stand gets destroyed, the person will also get destroyed. So he was a bad guy already. Okay, that makes sense. Oh. Yo, my question is, why is everybody sleeping still? Shouldn't they be awake? No. The pilot is also asleep. There has to be. No? No, no. Not everyone's asleep. Hey, they're not asleep. Did, did they not notice the ruckus back there? <laughs> if only if women are actually like this, it, it wouldn't be so hard. <laughs> He's just so shocked. Oh no. They killed already. Oh, the altitude's falling fast. They're falling fast. How is he still alive? I thought he was ripped apart. Oh boy. So he is taking them all down with him. That is some insane loyalty right there. There stands in a war can you imagine? He's the master of stands. So, so he has like the strongest stand, or does he have like every stand's power? Oh, now he's dead, right?
Wait, you're telling Joseph to drive this plane? I mean, he does. Oh, no. He crashed a plane three times. Oh, no, Jotaro. I forgot. I forgot Joseph has crashed a plane three times already. That means they're going to crash again. He has no confidence in himself. Oh. Well, I mean, he crashed when they did pretty well. I'm not going to lie. They went to Hong Kong? Okay. Okay. Million dollar view. Wait, hot cola. Hawk? Why would you want hot cola? I would rather take cold cola. Pork and century egg. Ooh, that sounds good. That sounds good. Yeah, hot. Yeah, cola definitely has to be cold. I'm sure he's calling the Speedwagon Foundation, right? Yeah, they definitely need to go and make a plan because normal way of traveling is definitely not going to work. Joe, to uh, I mean... Dio is coming after them too, not just them going after them. Them going after them, that didn't make sense. You, but you guys know what I mean, right? Come on. Yeah, but like, these stand users are, like, they do not care about other people. Like, they will do anything to take these people down. They're not like, you're like, un unloyal people who just like, they'll run on if they can't. Defeat them, they're like they will take them down. Apparently, I mean it's pretty obvious that Dio does not want to meet these people. Okay, so now now they're just having a lot of plans right now. So so now they're going by sea instead of by air, and they're definitely not going by land because of border for issues. Stand users, what Dio sent against them? Yeah, the stand users are pretty dangerous. Is this our next guy? I just see know so much about their culture. Really? Is that actually true? Why does he know so much? Holy, I think he just ordered the whole menu. Frog? I mean, he is rich. Is he just randomly gonna invite this French guy to join the table? <laughs> I'm not gonna even question him. Okay. Oh, another stand user, maybe. Oh, he knows them. He's definitely sent someone sent my deal, right? What is that? Is that is that like a water is that, is that a water stand or something? Well, I feel bad for this restaurant. Is this restaurant gonna be okay? What on earth is that? It's a water stand, isn't it? Oh man. A water stand with a sword. 
chariot. Silver chariot. You want me to die first? I made a fire clock on that table. Okay. It's nine right now. Holy cow. Okay. Wow, that was a very, very short episode. Um, wow, that was a short episode. Okay, everybody, so we have finished episode four of the Stardust Crusaders, and I have to admit, this new French guy is definitely our next opponent. Uh, he has a stand named Silver Chariot, maybe? Maybe, I don't really know. He, he popped out of the teacup, so I'm just assuming he has some sort of water power. And he has a sword because, uh, I mean, I'm saying he has a water power because he obviously just shrugged off the fire attack from Magi from Magician Red of, of uh, Abdul's uh, stand. And I don't know. Wow, why does he have, like, broken heart earrings? Like, that's an interesting design. Like, and his... Sh shirt? Is, is, that, is he wearing a shirt? I don't know. Is, is he wearing like tights? Tights? Shirts? With like some sort of weird armor? I don't know. He has a really, really weird outfit. I have to admit. But then again, JoJo's is pretty weird. So I, I'm not going to judge them that much. And that fly. That fly was uh, it's kind of pretty random. Like, I mean, yeah, I, I understand. It was sent out by Dio to like end them before they can even get to each other. I mean, he succeeded, not, not, nothing the less. Like, he, he succeeded in like, um, somewhat stopping the Joe Stars from uh, reaching Egypt and definitely gave them a huge detour because now they're stuck in Hong Kong, which is uh, pretty sad if you, because I'm thinking a lot of people died on that plane and the pilots that, victim so it's it, we, we can we can tell by how death like like how serious Dio's taking this uh this fact that uh Joe Stars are coming to him and you can tell that he does not want to meet them because he is sending out so far Kakuing uh that fly guy and now this uh silver chariot dude uh the, yeah, the, the French guy, the, the French guy now is after him. So he is just sending people, a, people after people, and I think Dio's kind of scared of them for some reason because, I mean, right now Dio is obviously not healed yet because he is still sucking the blood. He, he also said that he's not healed yet, so he's probably biding his time. He's probably getting more powerful at this moment. He's probably biding his time. Because he is just uh, throwing them off, like, off, like not off course, but delaying them as long as he can. Because he is just throwing people at them at this point. So yeah, that that's my uh, summarization, a little prediction, I don't know. Uh, yeah, so if you guys enjoyed my reaction, please leave a like. Please leave a, drop, drop a follow, comment, uh, I, I don't know. Hey, give me some advice. Uh, help me out with this name, with these names. They're they're, they're hard. They're, they're hard. I I feel like I'm butchering uh, a Avadul's name in uh, Kakil Kakilwing. I I think I don't know. Hey, if there's if there's more people's uh, names coming up, I I have a feeling I'm not gonna pronounce them correctly. So please, please guide me, correct me. Do whatever it is that, that, that can improve your experience. Because I don't want to butcher their names. And I want to get things right. So yeah. Um, as usual. Uh, thank you. Uh, and that's the end of this video. And I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Uh, yeah, bye.